watching YouTube all day today is what led me to making this video. So let's just get into it. <laughs> um, originally, I was going to film just a big bikini collection video, but I cannot do a full video of that. So let's just dive right in. Every girl, even boys in Hawaii you know that Acacia is the brand that you buy your girlfriend or even your mom when you want to show her like this is the first one I'm going to talk about which is actually for sale so if you want to buy it I'll have my Instagram Poshmark and Mercari linked down below three different ways to purchase because I like to give options <laughs> so the first one Honestly, I only bought this top because I love this print. It is the Thai print. I'll just do a little close-up. It is so cute, so hard to find. It was the orig ori <laughs> It was originally the Barcelona top, and I say originally because normally this top has like fringe, a lot of fringe, but I did not like that and I wanted it to be more supportive, so I cut the fringe off and braided it into a halter in hopes that it would fit me well but <laughs> it does not because I bought a petite anyway it has this really cute back like it's just really really cute yeah oh, so sad that it didn't wear but whatever I don't know the name of this print which is bad but it is in the Maui style bottoms and it's a size medium so it is really cheeky and it's this really really cute like it's just like a lot of cute different color combinations it has browns pinks dark pinks you know and then it has this really cute like detailed sides it is just so cute and then the matching top I got I was so skeptical about this because it is a petite and I have never fit petite but this top is actually so flattering it has this really cute fringe it's the same exact as the bottoms and it has cute fringe on the strings as well oh this bad boy okay this so cute okay I don't know I I think this is like 2013-2014. Uh, why is this red? There we go. This is the Island Orchid print in um, the Bronx style and it's a size small. And it is just oh, so cute. Like this cute little detailing. Oh, I am just so in love with this piece. And let's see if it has a stretch. It has a bit of a stretch for us taller girls. Even, let's see the sides. Even the sides? Okay, yeah. So, anyway, next. So, I'll just do my second one piece also right now. This is the Malka one piece, pretty sure. And, um, um, Modern Pacific, I think. I don't know. But it is so cute, like, it has this cute detailing. It has, I've noticed that the one pieces are actually a little more on the conservative side. Let me see if I can show this better. But I think that's really smart. Okay, it has some stretch. Again, this is a small. Okay, yeah, it's a pretty good stretch. <laughs> Getting into the two pieces again. The next one I got these black um, kawaii style bottoms. These are size medium. So it has really, really cute sides. I think they were only like 60 bucks. Um, the next bottoms are also black. And these are called the Verona bottoms. These are a little bit higher waisted. I really, really wanted black high waisted bottoms. And I got these for a steal. I got it for like $40 I think something really good and these are small but they fit me really well I was kind of scared and they have this really really cute sides it's a little more 
not tangled, it just has a lot more details. Overlapped layers, if you can kind of tell. These are a little bit more fuller coverage, which I like. Um, and then next, oh, this next, oh, okay. I'm literally, I have the matching set. Rust Magnolia has been my favorite print of me. This, I don't even think this is the current season anymore because they just keep coming out with like new capsules, little collections, but this was my favorite print lately. It is just this like rusty orange, reddish like color. And then it just has these really cute flowers. And then the, it's a really supportive top. I mean, it's a large, so it's bigger on me. It has a lot of coverage support. So obviously it just depends on what size fits you or what size you pick or how big your boobs are, honestly. And then the back is just this really simple and it has like the four straps. And I cannot remember the name of this top, but whatever. And then the matching bottoms, these were on my wish list for so long. Ever since I got those that top, I knew these were the bottoms I wanted. These Rust Magnolia Queens bottoms, they, oh, I love them so much. Uh, and they have this really, really cute design on the sides. This just simple kind of cross, like just the little details, you know? The one thing about these bottoms that kind of bums me out that I've noticed is these fit a lot tighter than I definitely expected. These fit me really well, size mediums, but when you put it on because of the side detailing, like for example, um, I have these in a small, which I'll talk about next, but it just did not, it was not flattering. But that's just something I've noticed about the Queen's bottoms is they're a little bit tighter. They're still super cute. I just would probably recommend going a size up. I mean, there's so many different variables, your butt, your thighs, like your stomach because these are high-waisted. So just something to think about with these. So. Since we're on that, these are the size small bottoms that I got. Uh, I knew in the back of my head I shouldn't have gotten these, but whatever. So, but they're so cute. I just wish I could, I just really want to find a bigger size. Queen bottoms in Upper East Side. They are so cute. I love the stripe. It's like, it's not white. It's kind of like an off-white with this brown. I think it's super cute honestly again has the sides really really cute sides just not my size so they're for sale and then the matching top I got is just this plain um, humu humu top and this is a size large so literally neither of these were my correct size I should have just gotten I should have just not gotten it but oh well so these are it's just a really simple cute top and this was also $60 and even though it's so plain it's still really cute and then oh okay so I'm actually done with all my bikinis so now I'll move on to the um, my pareo and my clothing pieces so starting off with my pareo adding to my rust magnolia addiction so it's just this really simple I mean the print itself is rust magnolia but it's just a pareo. I think I got it for 40 It's just really light in terms of durability. I really don't know. Honestly, I'm not gonna try to rip this or anything, but I do get scared if it snags on something. It's, you know, just something to think about. Had to take a, a brief pause because my mom came in and was talking to me. Anyway, on to the next. The first Acacia clothing piece I ever bought was this Rust Magnolia Flores dress which is just a really cute mini mini midi dress I, it definitely depends on how tall you are your body type how short it's gonna be I like this dress I'm not in love with it because of a few different reasons for one I need to get the straps um, tightened. I can see it because whenever I wear it, it hangs, it goes a little low, which is something to consider. I'm 5'8", like I've stated before, and this dress, with how low it is, it goes like 
right above my butt. <laughs> so, the Flores dress, I really like it. It is the rayon material. Yeah, it's a really cute length though. I love the length so much. Uh, last but not least, definitely not least, so cute. I've been wanting one of these for a long time because just the detailing, it's just really flattering on. Burrawa. Burra, burra, burrawa. Uh, here. That's what it's called. <laughs> In size small. And this was $172 plus tax. I personally do not wear maxi dresses like ever. I just love the top. So what I've essentially decided to do with this dress because it literally, it goes to my feet. I'm a 5'8 and this is a size small. So keep that in mind if you're gonna be purchasing a maxi dress from them. What I'm gonna do, first of all, I need to adjust the straps again. And then I'm going to get it hemmed professionally. I'm not sure if it's gonna be at my knees, right above or right below, probably right above. I'm gonna have it hemmed and then with the remaining material, so it'll kind of be like this, I'm gonna have them hem, um, cut this and then hem it and have them make a pareo out of it. I just thought it would be so perfect because I'm not gonna wear it as a maxi dress, so I figured if I got this hemmed, I would wear it a ton. And then I'll have a like whole other pareo. And if I wore maxi dresses, I'd wear it a lot as is. But I don't, so. <laughs> but anyway, we have come to the end of my Acacia uh, collection haul. You know, I just, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I enjoyed, so <laughs> thank you.